first of all, I'd like to apologise for my um, wet sleeves and um, my bloodshot eye. I've got soap in it. We'll gloss over that. This is my creation, the P45. Um, now, the idea is you can drive this to a railway station and then you pop it on the train or a coach or whatever, go to the next city and then you can use it there as well. It's road legal. Can I just make sure, because I think I might have missed something here. You started off apologising why your arms were wet and then didn't explain why. Because they've got water on them. Yeah. I actually do travel back and forth in the West Country on the train. You say you can take that with you. That looks quite big to get on That's the because train companies um, put seats in their carriages, which, of course, they needn't do with this. If you just produced a carriage, you could drive in and just sit there. In it. Hold on a minute. So, at the moment, you can't get it on a train? Not as such. No. So, you've got to rely on the train companies redesigning their trains for you to get this on the train? Well, redesigning is quite easy. You just take the seats out. What would it cost to have one of these on the road? £8,000. £8,000? What would you make them for? It'll cost 4000 to build. By children or are you going to get adults? Can you really get children to work in a factory? Because that would be brilliant if you could. Well, Jeremy, I'm the last dragon in and I, you know, I tried to tempt him by making an offer, but never come in with me. Sorry, I can't understand the word he says.